So on a busy morning, we have a bowl of red cayennes and serranos to make a pain salve. Now these have already been dehydrated. Pain salve is going to be made uh, or with, by grinding this into a powder, adding them to in this miniature crock pot. I'm actually not gonna plug it in just yet. Uh, and as it warms, we'll unplug it, let it cool. After it cools, plug it back in, let it warm again. We're gonna do that four times. One cup of oil. This much of another fat. Plug that in. When that other fat melts, that lets me know that's warm enough so I can cool it down. And then when it cools down, I'll reheat it again. And I'll do that for a series of four times. Now, I'm not going to stir it until the white fats have mellowed or blended. This will get labeled spicy or um, cayenne or red pepper. Uh, this is all the seed from everything that was in that bowl. All of this will get packaged in a baggie or a bag or a jar and that will be the seed for next year. Uh, I'll actually probably put it all in this. It's already dried. Here, I will do a, a bed of mixed peppers. They'll be, um, they'll all be mixed and I'll have them either in a row or a full bed. Uh, so I got to mark that too. I said everything I got to mark to the side. So um, that can be used again. And I don't cover this, uh, so it helps me keep an eye on it. So it's been one hour and the white fat has melted. Um, when this cools, I'm just going to put it back, put it back in and let it go take again. about 30 minutes to cool down. 
and I'll let it go for another hour and then pull it and do that four times. So I have my double boiler here. I've got a pot with a Pyrex bowl on top and I am going to mix in the beeswax. That's what I have right here. I have it uh, grated down into little shavings. And I'm just gonna add this right in. Now we're just blending in the beeswax. So all of the beeswax has melted down. I got the heat turned off. So now I'm just uh, ready to pour it up. I'm gonna pour it up in a jelly jar and then uh, label it um, as a cayenne paint salve. Put today's date on it. But it is good and red. All right, so we got a sterile jar here. We had it in the oven, got it sterilized. the water off of the bottom what was in the double boiler like mess. There's that. That is going to be a pain medicine for achy joints, um, sore muscles, heat. I'm just going through and trying some on my wrist. The jar is still hot. You want it to cool before putting the lid on it. And that's that, folks.